Hey everybody, it's been a while since we've been on our channel and active on it, but with uh, the new Star Wars movie coming out, we thought we'd get uh, cracking with a new build. This is something I've always kind of wanted to build. Um, this is a Hoth cannon out of recycled material. Uh, the different parts here that we use, um, this is actually a pin top just took apart and rearranged. Um, this top here is actually made out of a, uh, and I have pictures kind of displaying the whole, um, <clears throat> the process that I made this. Um, so this is the actual finished build. Did some um, different color schemes and things like that to kind of make it look real, give it some worn blaster effects. Um, but really it's it's made out of recycled material this was uh the base of it here or the body of it here is is actually a um container that i got from uh a soup uh got some soup at, at a chinese restaurant and they they put it in a container actually it was full so it's upside down this bottom piece here i actually have another one here but this is actually from a uh a cd spindle so you put your CDs on here or where you get like blank CDs. So that's what the bottom of this is here. Um, and the top part, again, is, is um, out of a, um, another container, just a Tupperware top actually cut in half. And the top for this is upside down. The top for the body is upside down here. So there's two uh, things kind of sandwiched together. Kind of looks like a bagel. Um, a lot of cutting, a lot of uh, hot glue that went into that. You can see all my hot glue and materials over here. Um, but this top part here, I'll take him out of here. I really wanted to make this playable. So it's actually a seasoning, the top from a seasoning um, jar. Uh, just ran out of some seasoning and I was like oh that looks cool it looks like a hat so um, cut that hole in there made it to where it would fit inside there and again I have all the pictures displaying on how I went about constructing this so if you want to make your own um, the deep details here are actually just uh, foam craft foam so it's that that pliable craft foam with the sticky uh, back or adhesive back um, I figured this would be a cool way to just actually give it some definition, put some paint on it. I'll turn it around here so you can actually see. Um, I just stuck this wire back here. This is um, from Diorama uh, Workshop. Uh, if you guys are familiar with their website, I'm sure everybody out there is familiar with their website. Um, this is just some of the decals. Um, that they have cutouts. I don't even know if I made these right. I don't think this one's right, but I just made it um, But I stuck a hole in here. It's supposed to be a generator boom um, But this is it guys um, Give you like the 360 of it And it's really just like sanded it down painted it white gave it a, a base coat um, painted it white it's weird though, it came out with a little bit of a texture feel, which is just like flat white paint. I don't know where the texture even came from. It might have been the way I was spraying it, but. Um, and then I, you know, shot it a couple times with a, uh, the primer, um, gave it some rust marks here and there with some um, just uh, dry brushing and, and a little uh, gray and black and red. You can see down in the hole there that actually moves back and forth and this is really it's just a pin I took it apart put it on put some craft foam on the end so it gave it more of like a cannon feel and boom that's it so um, next I'll be putting it together with the rest of my Hoff um, figures I'm really into Hoth right now um, I had a lot of Hoth uh, uh, figures and things, but I've moved several times in the last five years, and that's one of the reasons why we haven't actually had any new material up on our YouTube. 
um, channel and thank you for all the fans that have been watching and um, you know our last movie is like almost 200,000 views and it's just like amazing I, I didn't look at it for like a year and a half and then I, I looked at it and I was like oh my god people it's really catching on so thank you for all the fans out there um, uh, there's plans to do another movie soon but right now we're we're in the building mode so um, hope you enjoy this something easy that you can make at home this probably took a couple days um, in terms of the time I, I don't even know how many hours it took but I was working on it a few days here and there after work and um, and really it was just trying to you know imagine using all these different types of recycled materials how I can actually build this thing and so I think more of like the imagination part took longer than the build did because I was just trying to figure out how to do it so um, again have fun it's all about being creative um, I've never owned a Hoff Cannon so this is like something that I really wanted and I could never find one for a good price um, I think the next one I'm gonna probably try to make is uh, the I think it's an ion cannon, the dish, um, or it looks like some kind of, uh, I don't know, it, it looks like a dish network thing with the cannon thing out of, coming out of it, I, I don't remember the name of it, but I'm thinking about making one out of this, but we'll see how it goes. <coughs> um, anyways, uh, that's it, Towntronics Film signing off, see you later, bye!